For more than two decades, Matt Lauer was a familiar face on morning television. The former news anchor joined The Today Show starting in 1994 and got promoted to co-host in 1997. During his career at NBC, Lauer interviewed numerous high-profile politicians and celebrities, building a reputation as a reliable journalist that viewers could trust to deliver the latest headlines as they woke up in the morning. However, that reputation was shattered when it was revealed that he had been fired for inappropriate sexual behavior towards an NBC colleague on November 29, 2017. Hello, everybody. Thank you for joining us. It's Wednesday. It's November 29th, and it's a very, very sad day. His former co-hosts Savannah Guthrie and Hoda Kotb announced his firing on the show that morning, saying they were heartbroken by the allegations. Lauer's firing shocked audiences and sparked serious discussions about sexual harassment and its consequences in the workplace across the country. Lauer, for his part, has repeatedly denied accusations of sexual misconduct in the workplace and has laid low for the past few years. His reclusiveness has sparked interest about his personal life and what he has been doing since the scandal broke. Four years later, the former TV personality has reportedly lost a lot of friends and prefers to spend time alone, according to People magazine. A source explained. People would check up on him for a while, but that stopped to a degree. He just stays to himself. He doesn't really reach out to people very much anymore or engage them, and so he's been losing touch with a lot of people. Lauer has reportedly kept a low-key lifestyle and is very selective about who he chooses to interact with, the inside source added. He only wants to talk to people who are gonna take his side. He still feels like he got railroaded. The outlet also reported that Lauer, who was once worth $100 million, had to make changes to his lavish lifestyle. The insider told People, When he left the Today Show, he didn't get paid a penny after he got fired. NBC stuck with that. He's presumably sitting on mountains of money, but then again, he had a lot of money in real estate. While Lauer is laying low, he also reportedly found a new romantic partner. In 2019, Page Six reported that Lauer was dating marketing and public relations executive Shaman Abaz. Meanwhile, it hasn't been easy for Lauer's ex-wife, Annette Roque. The former Dutch model reportedly went through hell in her marriage to Lauer. According to Us Weekly, their union might have already been at a breaking point before his controversial behavior even made headlines, one source alleged. She stayed for Matt's career, and more important, for their kids. There were cracks in the marriage from very early on. Matt has always been a ladies' man, and there were affairs in the beginning. But it was the last five years of their marriage that seemed to be the worst for Roke. And while she's mostly kept a very low profile after Lauer was given the axe from the Today Show, one social event that she attended at the Hamptons during the summer of 2021 must have made things very awkward for her. According to Page Six, Lauer was at an outdoor event in the Hamptons back in August with his new girlfriend, Shaman. Sources said that even though Roke was only a few feet away from her ex and the new love in his life, she mostly kept to herself while trying to avoid any and all eye contact with the former morning television show host. For the most part, Roke has focused on living a life that is as private as possible with the three children that she shares with Lauer, and while Roke has not made any comments about her divorce, nor has she done any interviews after Lauer's firing, when asked about her ex-husband's misconduct, her lawyer did tell People in a statement back in 2019, "...in response to your inquiry, our client has asked us to tell you that now that the parties are officially divorced, her priority and only concern is for their wonderful children." Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more Nicki Swift videos about the latest hot topics are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.